Yes. Are you positive about the destination? Yes, don't worry. Now be quiet. I'm ringing up Daddy. You said it was the mountain of Alpuzu, didn't you? So, is it or isn't it Alpuzu? Hello? Yes, it is the mountain of Alpuzu, uh -huh. you dimwitted uh -huh. fat head. Tilda, is that you? Yes, it is I, Daddy. But I didn't mean you. I meant Farhat. I always thought of him as a right smart lad, not a fat head. Yes, Ordinarily, his intelligence is not subnormal. Not subnormal. Huh. The problem is that he's asked me about 11 times if I've calculated our next objective properly. Why, the nerve of the bloke not to trust my wonderful, stupendous, infallible genius of a daughter. And I, infallibly, have calculated that we must reach Al Puzu Mountain in the middle of the Sahara, where the sixth and next to last fragment of the Shariman will appear. And as usual, you're in an hurry because there's not much time left. That's right, Daddy. Do you know that Igor Khan and Snarchkov had even kidnapped Ben's cousins in order to stop us? Oh, oh, Lord love a duck, what a blooming disaster! Oh! Don't worry, we freed all the cousins, but now we must rush. There are only 31 hours, 18 minutes and 27 seconds left. Come on, let's get moving. isn't ready yet, is it? Several of the ingredients need to macerate for a few more days, but I got some giddy-up gig for the camels. <laughs> All right. Everyone mount. Brother Camel, I entrust my life to you. Not to mention my backside. So go softly, please. Uh, here we go with the giddy-up gig. What the heck's that? Mm -hmm. It looks like an armored knight. Goodness gracious. Yeah, I ain't seen no one in a monkey suit like that for centuries. He doesn't look very friendly. We don't have time to waste. Ali, take care of him. Sure thing, boss. Just gotta change potions. Warrior gig! Is not possible. This mounted night machine is costing me fortune and is not worth rubble. My idiot engineers have guaranteeing it indestructible. The Fafufniks, they are going to be out of jobs very. Oh, really? You shouldn't give up so easily. I thought you were still guzzling down my petrib. Er, I mean, uh, restoring yourself with oil. Yes, but I sensed you were up to one of your tricks, and I wanted to check it out. I was just trying to get some action going. It was not my intentions of offending you, uh, Master. I am not offended, but your pathetic footling attempt has given me a fine idea. Have you ever heard of the Code of Honor of the Bedouins? Uh, 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 you are meaning stupid rules of chivalry as practiced by smelly desert people? You do ill to undervalue the importance of honor among the Bedouins. Because thanks to it, I will capture Farhat in a trap with no exit! <laughs> Prince Farhat ben Asair, I challenge you to a duel according to the solemn code of honor of the desert. Doesn't that silly toad know that the night is made for snoring? Him again? I should have a few drops of that potion left. No, wait. You? Didn't you hear what he said? Oh, yeah. He challenged you on the code of honor. Well, kiddo, get in there and mop up the floor with him. Bend my blade. Right away. You're not intending to. Don't worry, Tilda. I got the kid in perfect shape. But Ali, he has to pick up the sixth <laughs> fragment in a few hours. He can't risk getting hurt just because. There ain't no other choice. Oh. <gasps> 
You mustn't <laughs> interfere. It too, Ben. That knight challenged him by the code of honor of the Bedouins. And so? If Farhat were to ignore it, he'd besmirch his honor. And according to the legend, the predestined one must remain pure in order to carry out his mission. Who can that blighter be? And why is he persecuting I think us? Probably it is the phantasm of an ancient warrior. Perhaps we have violated his territory. But if he's a ghost, then why? Man or ghost, a challenge is still a challenge, Tilda. I don't get it. Go, Bubba, let be go! Right. <laughs> Way to go, kiddo! <laughs> you might want to withdraw your hand from the ring! <laughs> Just as I thought, we're dealing oh. with a ghost. Well, then let's fold our tents and slip silently away. All right. And yes, you're right, Tilda. We should be going. Uh, ben, would you mind? Mm -hmm. I watched you while you were dueling. You were marvelous. You know, you really are a preux chevalier. <laughs> but if you ever expose yourself to needless risks like that again, I'll give you a belt in the gob, I will. I must say, I never expected to hear anything like that from the predestined prince. I'm afraid it's the truth. If I don't get my full eight hours, I feel like a wash rag the next morning. Prince Farhat Ben Asser. Howling sandstorms. I heard that voice before. I challenge you to a duel according to the solemn code of honor of the desert. Oh, no, not him again. You're not going to be such a bonehead as to do it again, are you? Oh. The Code of Honor of the oh. Desert is a law unto itself. Well, as far as I'm concerned, it's out and out lunacy. Ah. Try to get moving. I remind you that we're short of time. All right, let's go. That poor, pathetic, weakling Farhat. He doesn't have the wit to realize the diabolical trap into which I am successfully luring him. Ah, Now go. Many a duel still awaits you. An endless series of duels! <laughs> Whoa! Time to check our route, isn't it? We're spot on, Farhat. Alpuzu is seven hours straight ahead of us. With Elise, giddy up, Gig. Our camels have wings on their feet. No one could keep up with us. Not even the ghost horseman? I'd bet my helmet on it. That's good enough for me. It seems you just lost your headgear. Huh? Prince Farhat Ben Asser, I challenge you to a duel according to the solemn code of honor of the uh, desert. Ben, set up the tent and let Tilda get some rest. I'll dispatch him quickly. It's not me that needs rest, Ducky. It's your blooming brain. <laughs> <laughs> For heaven's sake, make him stop. Bear up, there's nothing to be done. That's right, with stupid gum brained dolts like you, nothing can be done at all. 
I know what you're feeling, Bubala, but the code of honor of the desert leaves no room whatsoever for doubt. <laughs> Whoever is formally challenged by the code of honor can accept no help from other parties, neither before, nor during, nor after the duel. That's shameful. Summing up, Whoever so does shall consider his honor be smite forever. Ridiculous. He's a tough customer, that ghost. For hat, shall I? Hold it, kiddo. <laughs> Don't you remember? Neither before, nor after, nor during the duel. Yes, I know. But look what sort of shape he's in. But look, Ellie, doesn't it seem strange that I keep cutting this horseman into a thousand pieces? But he keeps coming back fresh as a daisy. You saw it yourself. He's a ghost. But aren't ghosts tied to the places they haunt? He's been following us for quite a piece. It must be a traveling ghost. Well, be that as it may, I suggest we get a move on. We're running a serious risk of missing the sixth fragment. I know what you're thinking. If I hadn't lost time in dueling, we could be grabbing a snooze instead of traveling under this burning sun. I didn't say a word. Rich, our hot I challenge you to a duel. Not him again. Travel on. I'll try to join you as soon as possible. Someone give me some water. You know you can't huh? accept help, kiddo. Come on, you can do oh. it. I've had enough of this adult painted foolishness. Way to go! Madmen, you're just a bunch of madmen. <laughs> Okay, we can go. You go ahead. I will bury this knight. Perhaps I can bring peace to his tortured soul. Noble horseman. Mashi Hanky Sin Sham What a wonderful idea I had. How long you were thinking, cursed little brat, is being able to survive? Our ghostly horseman will keep him so busy, he'll never be able to pick up the sixth fragment. That will be the end of him. He will have lost everything. <laughs> Prince Farhat Benasser, I challenge you to a duel according to the solemn code of honor of the desert. I can't believe it. Not again. <laughs> Prince Farhat Benasser, I challenge you to a duel according to the solemn code of honor of the desert. Prince oh. <laughs> 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 Farhat Benasser, I challenge you to a duel according oh, no, to the I know. solemn code of He's honor of the come back again. Desert. Prince Farhat Benasser, I challenge you to a duel. Prince Farhat Benasser, I challenge you. Prince Farhat. There, that high peak is the mountain of Alpuzu. Hurry, chaps, we haven't a moment to lose. 
Farhat, you simply can't give in this time. We'll miss out on the sixth fragment. I'd like to heed your words, Tilda, but I have no choice. Truly, I'm very sorry. Oh, do you realize what's going to happen here? We're going to lose out on our appointment with the sixth crystal. According to the Saracen Chronicles, the great Ahmed Mawati was the only man ever able to fight 17 consecutive duels, succumbing in the last of them. And do you know how many Farhat has fought so far? Um, uh, 16, right? 19 foolish duels. 19! That kid's a winner. Don't you realize it's only a matter of time before Farhat succumbs? I understand, but the cold! So you've waited nearly 900 years just to see everything uh, fall apart for a foolish uh, reason? Uh, you did it! Great going, kiddo! It's just a I'll scratch, do worry aid about kit. it. It's only... No, you've forgotten what I learned you. The code of honor forbids you should help him before, after, or during. Huh? You can all go to the devil! Let's hit the trail. Come on. Parfumo. I was forgetting a cardinal tenet of logic. Every problem carries its own solution within it. Yeah. Yeah. Ha! 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 You rusty old tin can! There's something strange going on here. Whatever it is, I'll find it out soon. Yeah! Yeah! Let's get back to the others! Ali Shamesh! Ashin Shila Shalinge! The horseman has lost a piece. I hope he is not breaking up. No, it was that girl, but it's not important. In a little while, Farhat will be lost forever. I say he falls in the next round. Want to bet? What's that? I am winning first million through illegal gambling. You were not knowing. Silence, wretch! Singing victory prematurely brings bad luck. <laughs> He's superstitious. I'm never knowing this. There it is. The mountain of Al Puzu. Yes, but there's not right. a moment to lose. The sun is beginning to set. Prince Farhat Benasser, I challenge you to a duel according to the solemn code of honor of the desert. But again? It's all right. Uh -huh. Fight him, but take your time about it. <gasps> Don't get caught off guard. Ben, put up the tent. Ali, come with me. But, but that's... The horseman's mask. I know I had one with me. Ah, here it is. <coughs> a scansion spectrograph. A spectrograph? You mean it measures ghosts? Not really. But this time it might very well work as a discoverer of false ghosts. Hey, it's traveling. <gasps> I got him before he could get too far away. <sighs> All right, chaps, let's take a butcher's. What do you expect to find in there, eh? Ha-ha! I was indeed sure of it. Of what? Howlin' Sandstorm, speak up, kiddo. This mask is made up of an alloy of wolfram and molybdenum. What are those when they're at home? They're metals discovered only a few years ago, so they can't be the armor of an ancient warrior. So it ain't no ghost, then. Something made by someone like... Snorchkov! Howlin' Sandstorms, then the duel... Sheer, unadulterated treachery! <laughs> Hold everything. The code of honor clearly states. Ah, heck with it. I gotta get a real killer of a potion here to. Uh, because. Because. Uh, we gotta save Prince Farhat right now. Then hurry, he's going down. Uh, 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 Pain about gig. 
And now, brave knight, go haunt the people that sent you. The sun's going down. One more no. effort. Oh, I'll never make it, never. Ollie, give me a potion. Son of a gun, I had to use all my most powerful elixirs to stop the horseman. So? I'll have to make up some energy gig, but it'll take time. How much? Um, an hour. Wait, Shadow will take care of it. I'm sorry, Farhat, but I used up all my energy, too, in those duels. Well, here's where Ben gets to play a part. Come, young master. I'm... <laughs> Ben, you did this when I was a child. I'm a lot heavier now. Be quiet and hold on. Um. <laughs> Our plan has been discovered, but it doesn't matter anymore. He's huh? in such sad shape that we have to take advantage of it. It won't take long. Demon oh. Eagle Khan and Abdul Snatchkov. I challenge you. What's to this? You according to the solemn code of honor of the desert. Out of my way, idiot! Yeah. How dare you! Yeah. Out of my way! Oh. I challenge you to a duel according to the solemn code of honor of the desert. Oh, dearest, it seems that we are having a problem, Skip. Feet. Do your stuff. We're almost there. Shadow, it's up to you. Go get it. Uh, I don't think I can make you it. You have to make it. Yes, the light. Oh, huh? I can't reach it. Yes! <laughs> Where am I? What is the time of day, if any? Just hold on a sec. Um, I'll get you back on your feet with a good jolt of energy. What gear. about the sixth fragment? You mean you don't know? I don't know what. It's in your hand. Uh, and whatever happened to that armored horseman? Mm. I believe he is mounting an honorable challenge in other quarters. Cursing this brat, we will making him pay. Yes, but first... What first? Demon uh, Ego Khan and Abdul uh, Snatchkov. I him again? ...to a duel according to the solemn mm. honor of the first desert. First we have to try to get rid of that uh -huh. unbearable nuisance. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. 